After my showdown with Jesse, I continued to track his brother, Frank, and that son of a bitch, Jim. I followed those bastards into the high mountains as they were going to ground. What mountains would that be? Somewhere in the Ozarks, I believe. The perfect place to hide out from the authorities. In fact, before I could find them, some Indians who fled the res and were hiding out from the military found me first. another whiskey, Ben. Nothing better to soothe the troubled soul. Now, where was I? Indians, right. I had more than my share of run-ins with you. <sighs> Not that time. Did I tell you about Grey Wolf? Yes, sir. You did. Ah, of course I did. In fact, I could still remember that old medicine man's words to me. Jesus Christ, we're back to that again. You carry great darkness in your heart. It will claim your soul. You will come to this place again. Kill many more men.
Consumes everything you are. Like that time. Did I tell you about Grey Wolf? Yes, sir. <laughs> ah, of course I did. In fact, I can still remember that old medicine man's words to me. Jesus Christ, we're back to that again. You carry great darkness in your heart. It will claim your soul. <laughs> you will come to this place again and kill many more men. will grow until it consumes everything you are. So, did you ever find him? Who? The man you are after. Let me ask you something, Ben. You ever think about death? Mr. Greaves, are you all right? Ooh, Won't you spare me over till another year? What is this that I can't see with ice cold hands taking hold of me? Oh, death. Oh, oh, oh death. Won't you spare me over? Till another year Well, I am death None can excel I'll open the door To heaven or hell Oh, death Someone would pray Could you wait to call me another day Just spare me over till another year. So are you gonna answer the question? What question is that? Jim Reed. Did you ever find him? Reed was indeed that son of bitch's surname. That's right, Ben. A despicable character. I remember him laughing like a hyena that cold morning they lynched me and my brothers. He was intent on avoiding my vengeance, but nothing was going to stop me. Nothing.
I finally did track those outlaws down. They had long rifles with scopes and were well positioned to pick off any poor soul who came anywhere close. I'm guessing Frank James believed I was responsible for the demise of his brother Jesse. I couldn't really disagree with the man as I thought Jesse was dead then as well. He backed off as I closed in on him, but he was still intent on killing me. And when I closed in on him again, he backed off again. Looking for a better angle on me. as I was there for the same damn reason myself. At this point, I'm guessing you think Silas Greaves is a worse murderer than Jim Reed ever was. No, sir. A man who spent half his life killing somebody's brothers, fathers, sons. I think you were just looking for justice, sir. Is that what I was looking for, Dwight? Is that what it was? Justice? Isn't that why you were hunting the James gang? The James gang. Right. I finally found a Shack? Well, it went tumbling right off that cliff. With Frank James still in it? Yes, sir. But Frank James is still alive, living in Missouri. Folks around the family farm for 25 cents I didn't say he tour. died in the fall, now did I? Ah! 
I'm done with this damnable outlaw life. Kill me, don't kill me, do what you will. At this point, I just don't give a shit. I explained to Frank that I had nothing against him personally and that I was looking for someone else. You want Reed? Have at him. I never did like that bastard. I am done here. We parted in peace as Frank pointed out the path to my prey before making his way back down the hill. So, what happened with Reed? Well, I finally found the last of the gang hiding in a nearby cave. First, I had to dispatch the lookout. But I was determined not to let that murderer escape my revenge again. Rather than wander in willy-nilly, I decided it would be better to smoke that some bitch out. Hey, Reed! I shouted. No wonder you're so ornery. Can't be easy being married to Belle Star. While you're off providing for the family, she's spreading her legs for every Tom, Dick, and Cole Younger. Not an attractive woman exactly, but very friendly. At least she was to me. Son of a bitch! It was then that the last bunch of bandits jumped out of hiding. Why won't this asshole give up? Would someone please kill <clears throat> Thank <laughs> you. 
Eventually, it was just me and Reed. I had waited a long time to face him down, so I could repay him for what he did to my brothers. And repay him, I did. Well, I don't know about you boys, but I'm pretty beat. Well, it's too damn bad you never found that Bob character. Seems a shame he never had to pay. Well, funny thing about that. I did have one more chance at him. Six months ago, I heard that Butch and Sundance were back in the States and had gathered up some of their old gang. I tracked them down, hoping that Roscoe Bob Bryant had returned with him. So, you're saying they didn't die down in Bolivia? That's what I'm saying. <laughs>